What's up babies? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to be doing a little chit chat. Get ready with me and I'm also going to get my nails done later so I'm going to vlog that for you as well. So I'm going to be getting ready on the floor today. You might be thinking, is she crazy? Well, a little bit but the floor is actually so freaking comfortable. Like I don't know why but when I sit on the floor I just feel so relaxed and just nice. Is that weird? <laughs> Um, so I'm actually a little bit in a rush so I have to hurry up because otherwise I'm gonna miss my nail appointment so I'm gonna do a little bit of a more natural makeup look today not really like a full glam makeup look so let's get started Today I'm going to be using some foundation and I haven't used foundation in like three weeks or something because I don't know, I just kind of took a break from it. I didn't feel like I need it. Well, I still don't think that I need foundation right now, but I just want to kind of switch it up a little. I don't know. I'm just, I'm just, I don't know. I'm just going to use foundation. This is the Too Faced Born This Way foundation, by the way. I'm in the shade Golden Beige. This is like my go-to foundation. I have like other foundations that I really love, but this is just a foundation that's like my top favorite right now, I guess. Wow, I'm just going to be applying some concealer underneath my eyes because I always oh there's a hair in here That's gross. Um, I also ha I also I always have dark circles Um, it's just kind of genetic. I guess I have Um dark circles always i've had them for all my life So I don't know they're just staying and not going away Which is pretty annoying, but also that's what concealer is for I feel like if concealer didn't exist, I would be lost. I'm going to be mixing a little bit of the Bourjois Healthy Mix Concealer in with my um, Born This Way Concealer. This is in the shade Medium, but I feel like it's actually like really, really, really light. Um, and I like to put this kind of like on top of the other concealer. And it kind of brightens up my under eyes a little bit more. I also like to put it on my forehead. A little dots on my chin. I'm just gonna take this brush from Iconic London and I'm gonna blend this out. Just setting this down with some powder. What's, oh, did you guys see that? I just, was that powder? There was something like white on my lip, I just totally ate that. <laughs> Gonna do a little bit of cream contouring with my Kiko stick. I feel like this stick matches um, me perfect right now, but if I get any more tan, tanner, tan, um, it's too light for me, which sucks. just like don't know what I need to talk about during like a get ready with me because I'm so focused like on my makeup that I don't know what to freaking talk about just going to be using some of my Sosu by Stan Jackson oh my god did I really just do this my nail through the blush fuck now I'm spilling it on the ground just going to be taking some of the contour shade and bronze on my face. I just feel like I will be like lost without bronzer. Bronzer, I think, is like the only makeup product that I could not live without, like concealer and bronzer. If I had to choose three makeup products that um, I could use, it will be concealer, bronzer, and chapstick or like lip gloss or something my camera just cut off while i was doing my eyeshadow um so i used the Too faced sweet peach palette and i used the color puree right here and i put that all over my eyelids and also in my crease and then i used the shade tempting right here which is like a really weird shade like this is kind of like a black 
greenish brown shade with a little bit of glitter and i put it on my lower lash line it kind of looks a little crazy because i didn't really blend enough um but that's what i did for my shadow now i'm going to be using some mascara this is the iconic london mascara i just really hate that i don't have eyelashes i feel like if I had long and beautiful eyelashes, my life would be complete <laughs> because my lashes are just non-existent. Like, I don't know what it is, but they just like grow straight and some of my lashes even like grow down. So there's like no curl in my lashes whatsoever. And I've tried so many eyelash curlers, but my lashes just won't stay up. Like even when I curl my lashes, they just like go straight down. I've used so many um, eyelash curlers and mascaras and I just give up, but yeah. I do have to say that this is like one of the best mascaras that I've ever tried. This is the iconic London mascara. It's like super black and the wand is like a plasticky wand because I don't like those, um, I don't know what to call them, like the fluffy wands. I only like the wands that are like plastic i guess or like a rubber i don't know what it is now i'm just gonna apply some lip liner um i still haven't found like my perfect lip liner shade yet so i'm like always mixing 500 lip liners together so today i'm going to be trying out the combination of mac cork lip liner mixed with sosu by suzanne jackson can't cook lip liner and sosu wild thing lip liner so i'm gonna start with Hmm. I'm gonna start with Wild Thing, which is like the darkest one, I think. Now I'm applying Cork. So now in my opinion, it's kind of too dark. So I'm gonna put some Can't Cope. That doesn't really make any difference. This is actually a super like pretty combination. So if you guys know any lip liner that looks like this, then let me know because your girl needs like just one lip liner because I'm always mixing three or like five different lip liners and I just want to take one with me like in my purse, like not five, just one, you know. I thought that this process was going to take a lot longer, um, but it's only 3.12 and I have to leave at 4, so... I actually have some time before I need to go okay okay guys so right now I'm in the car I'm gonna leave right now it's around a 20 minute drive well like a 30 minute drive when I drive because I drive kind of slow because driving alone gives me anxiety so yeah I'm gonna get my nails done I've had these on for three weeks they actually don't look bad at all um, but I'm just, you know, kind of tired of the color. I get like really tired really fast of like the same nails. So yeah, I'm actually pretty happy that it's three weeks because sometimes I do four weeks, sometimes I do three. Also, the weather is um, disgusting. It's raining and the lighting is so freaking bad. But okay, I'm gonna leave right now. Yeah, you have to come. No boys allowed. Yeah, not the. I don't know done my nails are looking super pretty i'm super happy with them um so now i'm gonna go home because i haven't had dinner yet it is 7 20 and i'm super hungry so i'm gonna drive home now and i will catch you guys when i'm home okay goodbye so right now it's a couple of hours later as you can tell it's already getting dark outside um i just wanted to say thank you for watching this 
vlog or get ready with me. I don't know what this is. Um, the makeup that I did earlier is almost gone. I like rubbed on my eyes and I kind of like here. I don't know if you can see it all rubbed off. Um, but yeah, thank you guys for watching to this video. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And we'll see you guys back in my next video.